This is the home behind me here where Michelle and Reagan Class were shot on the morning of July 7th. And right down here around the bend is where court documents show the shotgun was found inside another home just one day later. That's, uh, that's progress. News of the shotgun being found in this home is a relief to area residents. Police came here twice in three days, recovered the 19-year-old resident's shotgun, plus jeans and seven shotgun shells. Ballistics testing proved the shells are a match to the four found inside the class home. But police say even with such a significant find, they still have no suspect. These neighbors share their theories about the owner of the shotgun. Terry Bridges knows the family. I don't think he did it. Okay, I think he might know something about it, but I don't think he did it. Everyone who lived in the area in 2003, including the class family, remembers this house for another reason. Former resident and ex-husband of the current owner, 42-year-old Christopher Green fired a shotgun at police when they came to arrest him. He's still in prison now, serving 19 years for assault and child molestation. He had some other stuff go on and he just kind of flipped out. Now this case, everyone hoping whoever this person is will soon be revealed by someone who just might have vital information and hasn't come forward yet. Neighbors say they and the classes need it resolved. That uh, makes you think that it could have been you or you might be next. Now we went to the door of that home today. A woman answered, but she wouldn't answer any of our questions and asked us to leave. We're live on North Virginia. Peggy Bright, KMBC 9 News.